Oh, hey there. I am Alexi, and today we will be talking about Dutch healthcare. Healthcare in the Netherlands might be quite different from the one from your home country. If you are an EU student and you have a European health card, probably you don't need another insurance. But make sure you are familiar with what is being covered by your insurer and when do you need to renew it. If for some reason you don't have such card, then contact the international office and they will make you a private health insurance. If you are a non-EU student, then the international office will arrange the health insurance for you for the first year. After that, you can choose your own if you want to. And after all the arrangements are done, you will need to find yourself a general practitioner. If you are based in Enschede, then you can register for the UT campus doctor. The links will be down below the video. If you have gone through any sort of treatment, you will get a receipt. After that, you can submit a claim to the website of your health insurance provider and you will get your money back. But it will depend on your package. It doesn't matter if you're an EU or non-EU student. If you have a part-time job or you earn a salary that is higher than the minimum wage, then you will still need to have a basic health insurance. However, the cases of internships are highly exceptional. There is a chance that you might get a mail from CAK or SVB and you always have to respond, otherwise you might get a fine. If you have a basic health insurance, you can also apply for a care allowance, which in Dutch is called Zorgtoislag. For more information, you can go to myinsaxion.nl. Additionally, if something is not clear, you can go to this website, where there is also a chat function if you have more questions. Thank you for watching. If you found this video useful, be sure to check our other videos. Bye, and stay healthy.